Hey folks, this is Nod, we're playing Space Engineers, and I've decided it's finally time to move my my rescued space station platform thing. I've been working on it for a few weeks now after rescuing it from uh, the pirates, and I've made it my own, and um, I think it's at a point now where uh, maybe I can actually like take it out and start actually living in it and doing stuff. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, use the jump drives. I've got, let's see, I've got two jump drives in this. Um, and we're going to take it over to my moon. And we're going to sit it up there. I've already created a GPS location for it. I scouted that out uh, a few weeks ago. Um, now the problem I could foresee is uh, if I jump this thing out to the moon, that'll be great and all, but then I've got no way of getting back to my asteroid base here. Because... Uh, <laughs> I need another jump drive capable ship, so um, I think we're going to use my puddle jumper. I have to find my puddle jumper. Where is it? There's the puddle jumper. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to um, we're going to send the puddle jumper ahead. This is a bit of a quirky thing I'm going to try here. So we're going to zip on over here, hang out with the puddle jumper, and I'm not. We're going to uh, the puddle jumper is basically just a little. Oh, I see. It's, it is a large ship, but. There's not much to it, it's just basically a jump drive, that's it really. Jump drive, some power, and an antenna. So um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to like send this out to my uh, to my moon, and uh, then I'm going to hop out of the seat at the last second before it jumps and just let it go without me. At least that's the plan. So um, let's see how that works out. <laughs> All right, let's get the sheet. Access my jump drive. Uh, Lunar Space Station, that's what we want. Select that. Okay, alright, so I'm going to send it on its way and hopefully. Uh, <laughs> what is that pirate there? It's a private sail, okay. Nothing to worry about. Alright, so here we go. We're going to jump this guy. Yes. And we're going to jump out of that. Bye bye, puddle jumper. Oof. <laughs> That's cool. All right. Um, hopefully that has arrived at my moon. Um, so I'll be able to use that to get home again. Is the plan. So now we get to jump the big station. Uh, I'm a nervous wreck. <laughs> uh, I hope this doesn't go horribly wrong. Did a lot of work on this thing. All right. Well then. Uh, Let's have one last look at her while she's still in one piece. Now, down the bottom here, I should point out we've got a uh, got my little mining ship I made. Cheese whiz here from mining the moon, as everyone knows, moons are made out of cheese. So that'll be tagging along for the ride, but that's certainly not going to be enough to get me home because it's just uh, ion drive only. So hopefully the puddle jumper is there, so I can use that to get back. I'm going to be either very happy or very bummed within the next couple of minutes. <laughs> All right. Most important thing is jump drives. Jump drives are fully charged. Okay. I think we're gonna go up to the bridge. How am I doing on energy and oxygen and stuff? Uh, you know, I should top up on those just in case uh, something goes horribly wrong. Okay. How are we doing on? 100% oxygen. 100% hydrogen bottle. Ready to go, and I got a few knickknacks. Just bear. All right, let's head on up to the bridge and jump this bad boy. Which way is the bridge? That way. Oh, it is gonna be exciting. Actually, I hope it's really dull and nothing exciting happens. <laughs> That's kind of what we're looking for here. Let's uh, head on up to the bridge. we go. Alrighty then. Which way is the front? Uh, I think we're gonna have this way is the front. Doesn't really matter. All aboard. Okay, so what do I got here? There's no fuel. <laughs> uh, i thinking actually I'm gonna turn on the backup reactors here for this trek. Normal operations, I don't. I'm just going to rely on the solar panels. But we are traveling here, so we're going to turn on the reactors. Okay, 
grenades and they're coming on. Uh, okay, I think weapons are turned on here. Let's see. Those weapons. Yes, weapons are turned on. Okay. Uh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. So, jump drive. Alrighty. Lunar Space Station, select. So, current jump 28%. Okay, so I can make it in one jump. Bonus. Alright, very good. Oh boy! <laughs> well, there's really only one thing to do, is press the jump button. Here we go! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What did that happen? Chip tries on and off. No, that's not the right more idea. Jump. Jump drive one. Jump. Got the wrong hotkey in there. Well, that was a bit of a light. Alright, let's try that again. Here we go. Pressing jump. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, jump destination. Lunar Space Station. Distance, 500 kilometers. Achievable scent, 100%. Okay. Weight transport port is uh, almost 4 million uh, kilograms. That's actually not bad because I think it was like 7 million when I started this. Uh, my renovations to this, so I've managed to hack off uh, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 million kilograms. So I've leaned, and the ship's a little leaner than she was. That's good. Okay, operational jump drives 2. Crew is seated one. Here we go. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I can't watch. <laughs> I see a moon. I see lots of panels. I think we might have arrived in one piece. Look at this. Whoa, cheese okay, cheese whiz is there. Where's puddle jumper? Puddle jumper. Um, puddle jumper. I see the puddle jumper. Where is it? Puddle jumper is about a kilometer away. Good. I was a little concerned that I might. You know, it's weird because I'm jumping the same coordinates, but clearly it has not put me right on top of the puddle jumper, which is a good thing because that would have been like a boom. Oh, I'm so happy I'm at the moon now. Sweet. So let's try maneuvering this beast. Hopefully the panels won't fall off. So I think we want our butts facing down. But I think it's space engineers, unlike Kerbal Space Program, we're not actually orbiting. We're just going to sort of sit here in a quasi-Lagrange spot above the planet here, and it'll just sit there, I guess. So I'm kind of tempted to take this down as low as I can go. So I'm going to mine from the surface, so I want to minimize the amount of travel time from the surface to here. So, uh... Ooh, look, there's ice over there. Looks like ice. I'm turning. Very slowly, don't want anything to fall off here. Oh, I think that's brown spots there, where my old base was. And the scars in the lunar regolith. Okay, there. Awesome. Alright, so I kind of, I think the next thing I want to do now is, uh, cheese whiz is still there, yes, good. Um, what is the best way of figuring out how high I can go before I hit the gravity well? I want to be just above the, uh, wherever the gravity well starts. So, I guess I just start going down and, uh, a well, little concerned the ion thrusters on this thing won't be powerful enough to keep me up, which could be a complete friggin' adventure. If I hit the gravity well and it's... oh no, it's tapered, right? It's not... you don't get the full 0.25 G's as soon as you... yeah, it should... I should be able to ease into it so that, uh... I was afraid if I get the full 2.5 G's and this thing obviously ain't gonna float on the diminutive little uh, thrusters I got on it, so I thought maybe it would just fall instantly, but I think I should be alright. So let's, uh... let's start heading down. I wish I kind of had some 
telemetry on the ground here so I can see how my altitude above it, but I think we're just going to head down with the inertial dampeners, um, I guess, off. Alright, should pick it up speed. As soon as I hit that gravity well, I want to turn the inertial dampeners back on. How fast do we want to get going here, though? Let's go about 20 meters per second. Okay, we're falling! So as soon as we see the gravity well, put on the inertial dampeners and go up. Let's get in badly. <laughs> oh boy. I get that ground rush thing going on here. So, actual gravity is half g, artificial gravity is 0.5. Whenever I get like the horizon line thing, actually I, sh I should see the little uh, world, the little globe symbol appear on my uh, my little gravity doodad there on the on the left. As soon as I see that, I gotta hit it. I think it's two kilometers above this moon is the, uh, is the is where the gravity well starts. Don't know how close we are. We're definitely going down though. Oh, I'm so glad those rotors survived the trip. Hopefully once I get this situated, I'll, actually they might fly off as soon as I hit this <laughs> gravity well. And hit the brakes, and you shall see. Hopefully it'll be a nice slow braking maneuver. I did have a ship with a whole buttload of hydrogen thrusters on it. And that thing pulled some serious G's when I... Uh, I turned that on and it, it used to like shred the ship. Things would come flying off. Ships docked in my hangar would just detach and come ripping through my hull and fly off into the uh, abyss. But this one should have a nice gradual slowdown, so uh, we are getting alarmingly close to the surface here. Oh yeah, boy. Kind of tempted to slow down a bit, but. I don't want to take the all day long to come down here. Descending, descending. It's really hard to say. It does look like we're still a ways up. If I had something on the surface, I could do a sort of like distance from it. That would help. And I can see how close to uh, two kilometers I'm getting. But I have no reference point from the surface other than just how big the moon's getting. Oh, there it is. Okay, brakes, brakes, brakes. Oh, we are slowing down really slowly. <laughs> oh no. Uh, this could be bad. We are slowing down though. But the planetary gravity is 0 0.06. Oh no, we're barely slowing down here. This is exceedingly bad. Press the spacebar, does it help? No, the thrusters are at 100%. We're speeding up. <laughs> oh no, we're dead. We're dead. <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy. Uh, is there anything I can do? Go forwards, maybe? No. Do I have more thrusters in a certain direction? What if I rotate 45 degrees? Does that double my thrusters somewhat? We are accelerating. <laughs> this is very bad. Point ten of a G. Oh no. <laughs> oh bloody hell. No my station. How oh, we got pirates to boot? Isn't that just awesome? Oh dear. Um can I turn the thrusters on on cheese whiz maybe? <laughs> uh, thrusters, cheese whiz, thrusters. And thrusters. Cheese with thrusters. Arm! Save me! No, we're still accelerating. Oh <laughs> god. No! Uh, that, that's very bad. Very bad, very bad. <sighs> da, 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 da. Ah, she was a fine ship. Oh boy. Yet yeah, that didn't go well. Oh boy. 
Isn't that a beautiful station? <laughs> oh my god. It's alright, the moon broke my fall. Wow. Yeah. Thank you.